like I said earlier, um, actually, there's a reason why two of our friends are not here today because they they actually asked me to speak on their behalf, on everybody's behalf. That we are tired. We have said everything. We have talked to everybody, and we have not lied a single moment. And we have fought through and through just to give uh, Miss uh, Miss Sharon the peace of mind that she wanted. I hope that she can find it in her heart to accept it, and I hope that she can help us to find the peace in our hearts because we have been traumatized and tortured and maligned by this experience. And I hope that she realizes that she is not the only one hurting, that there are other 11 other mothers hurting right now, that there are 11 people, innocent people, who are hurting right now because of all the bashing and all the... Whenever people search their names online, this will haunt them. What more the experience of finding your friend dead in a bathtub and trying to revive her, trying to bring her to the hospital, and then suddenly being accused of murdering her. That is unfair. That is injustice. So I hope, I hope that they open their minds and finally listen and see and read the evidence and finally find it in their hearts to let go so that we can let go.